Hi, my dear students, it's math time. So our learning target is to read and write numbers up to 100,000 in symbol and in words. Have you gone to Boracay, Aklan? Boracay is one of the top tourist destinations in the country. Thousands of tourists from other countries visit the island of Boracay every year. Did you know that in 2016, the top visitors were South Koreans, numbering about 300,000? Looking at the chart, these are the number of tourists who visited Boracay in 2016. We have Koreans, Chinese, Taiwanese, Malaysians, Americans, Australians, Singaporeans, Saudi Arabians, British, and Japanese. So, how many digits do you see in each numbers? We have 5 digits and 6 digits. Can you read the numbers? So, reading large numerals is easier with the aid of the place value chart. First thing, my dear students, to read the numbers, okay, you need to start with the digits in the highest period. In this place value chart, the highest period is the thousands. Second, read the digits as one number followed by the name of the period. So in the place value chart, 57 followed by the period thousands, but you need to remove the S, so it will become 57,000. Next, read all the succeeding period names except the units period. So we're not going to tell or say the units. So we have 765. So this number is 57,765. So let's let's read the numerals in the place value chart. Can you please read it loudly? This number is read as 78,900. 14. Another example. This number is read as 527,461. Now this time, we read it on your own. This number is read as 34,000. 970. Can you please read loudly? This is read as 177,926. Read it loudly. This is read as 292,174. So always remember, my dear students, always read numbers from left to right. Think of place value when reading number words and numerals. Now let's move on. In writing large numbers as numerals, we use a comma or provide space to separate the periods. So example, 627,000. 812. Using a comma, so we write 627,000, 812. Providing a space, 627,000, a space, 812. Another examples, 111,201. So using a comma, it's 111,000. 201. Providing a space, 111,000, space 201. Next, 347,655. Using a comma, 
347,000, a comma, 655. Providing a space, 347,000, a space, and 655. So always remember, a space or a comma separates the period in writing numbers in symbols. Always remember, my dear students, numbers are written in words in the same way that they are read. So that ends my lesson. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Bye!